Hi guys, it's Jacqueline Hawkins, founder of Women's Hockey Life Academy, where we help players and families navigate the recruiting process and obtain scholarship money. Now in this video, we're going to put all the pieces together and talk about what it really takes to take control and own the recruiting process so that you can live your dream. So in this video course, we've talked about some pretty amazing things so far. If you haven't watched the other three videos in this series, then please watch them now. But if you've been going through the videos in order, then congratulations, we've accomplished a lot together already. So let's recap. First, we know your university goal and why that's so important for you to achieve. So I want you to think about that goal now. I want you to reconnect with it as well as the reason why it's so important to you. So we know that goal and we know why you need to achieve it. Your true value. Now hopefully I've also shifted your own perception of your own value. I want you to see that the outcome you can provide a university and team, whatever that is, is needed by a coach out there somewhere and that you now truly believe in yourself and what you're capable of. And that marketing yourself to coaches is the key to getting seen. And that you take on the responsibility of doing that marketing and don't rely on anyone else to do it for you. And we also talked about the importance of leverage and why it's so important to create financial freedom to decrease the stress associated with paying for university. Now, when you put this all together, you actually have something really special, a step-by-step -step game plan for taking control of the recruiting process and earning scholarship money. Can you see that? All right, of all of the videos that I've shown you so far, this one is gonna be the most critical for you to pay attention to. Because as far as your recruiting process goes, this is where the rubber meets the road. Right, so we've talked about some of my clients and a bit about my personal experience, but now we need to talk about the most important person of all. Let's talk about you. In this video, I'm going to walk you through how you can start to put these ideas to work in your recruiting process so that you can live your dream now without the frustration and overwhelm that you've been probably struggling with. So something that is true with the WHL Academy is that Success happens fast because the system is so simple, it doesn't take years and it doesn't even take six months. When success happens, it happens fast. Right? Let me show you what I mean. This is Emma. Emma is a goalie attending a hockey academy in North America. Now, when she first came to us in the summer, she was struggling with getting exposure and how to leverage her academics with her athletics. You see, Emma didn't play on a club team, so feared she was missing out on being seen. Her and her parents were also unsure of where their money and effort should be going to get the best possible outcome. So we discussed several camps and showcases for her to attend in the coming year. The only problem with that was she was about to enter her sophomore year, her grade 10 year, and we wanted to get her seen sooner rather than later. But all of the camps and showcases were full. Or so she thought. We had her reach out to one of our contacts to be placed on a waiting list. I kid you not. Two days after emailing our contact, a goalie got injured and she was asked to attend one of the most highly recruited showcases that summer. The ball has been rolling ever since. Okay, so Emma's story and Sarah's and Aaron's, they aren't accidents. They didn't get lucky. They just followed a simple system that works. This is just the tip of the iceberg. We have tons of stories just like these. Way more than I have time to take you through. But the big question I want you to ask yourself is this. Why are these people getting results when so many others are struggling? And that's a very important question to ask because anytime you can learn from someone else's experience rather than having to go through all the heartache and struggle yourself is a good thing, right? But you already know that. You know that because you're watching these videos and that's smart because you know that you don't want to reinvent the wheel if someone else has paid the price. If someone else has gone through the struggle to figure out a system that works and you want it. So good for you. So here's the dirty little secret of the recruiting world. Most systems out there, most coaches who help families navigate the recruiting process aren't that good. How do I know that? Because our clients have told us. Because every phone call I take is from another parent telling me how they use this company or that company who promised to help them and yet there they are on a phone call with me still looking for help. You know, they'd spent $10,000 or more between the cost of that coach's service being sent to the wrong camps and showcases, and unfortunately that money went into programs that just couldn't deliver. So if you've been in other programs and you're still stuck, then you know that's the truth. 
Now don't get me wrong, there are programs out there that can help you, but they typically only give you pieces of the puzzle. They don't put it together for you step by step. That's why we spent our own money and invested countless hours to develop WHL Academy. When we had our first clients go through the program and when Audrey committed to Amherst and Sarah to another NCAA Division III school, that's when we saw the power it's capable of. Now we know it's not perfect, which is why we'll always refine the system, but I believe we have the only program out there that can really empower you to take control of the recruiting process and earn scholarship money. Now most programs fail because they lack the three things that you need to get real results. Number one, they have to teach a simple, proven, and fast strategy. A step-by-step -step system. Not a grab bag, not an overview on how to do something, but step-by-step. -step. Number two, once they give you the system, they have to help you execute it. They're going to hold your hand. They're going to help you execute each step so that you can get it right. And number three, they have to support you in your mindset. Because look, we're all human beings. We all have freakouts, we all have meltdowns, and we all have times where we get totally stressed out and feel like we can't go on. So they have to support you and your mindset. Now, I designed WHL Academy to do all three of those things for you. So first of all, the step-by-step -step system works like this. We get you clarity on the university goal and what you want out of your university experience. Then we tap into your current recruiting process to make sure you're not missing out on any opportunities. Even if you're just starting out and haven't begun communicating with coaches, we'll get you started. Then we roll out the WHL Academy system, just like I showed you. We create your player profile. We search for schools based on your needs. We get you to contact coaches. And we make recommendations on the camps and showcases that are right for you and your university goal that you set. So the system is there for you. It's all step by step. But here's the thing. We also help you execute. Okay? You're probably not an expert in knowing what information coaches really need to know about you. You're probably not an expert in knowing how to write an email to coaches and knowing what they want in those emails. If I just taught you some stuff and sent you on your way to figure it out on your own, you're probably never going to get the results that you want. You'll probably never get it done. And remember, it's not information, it's transformation. Just like with our other clients, you know, when you work with a coach, you don't want to just learn some stuff. You want your recruiting process to be measurably, dramatically better than when you got there, don't you? And just knowing some cool new tricks isn't enough, now is it? So when we work with our clients, we are super hands-on to create results, and that means we are looking at every piece of the system. We're logging into your player profile. We're helping you rewrite your university goal. We're looking at your list of schools and making suggestions you may not have thought of. We're going out and finding you non-athletic and non-academic scholarship money. We're working with you on all these things to make sure you actually get the outcome. Okay, and third, we take care of your mindset. We hold you accountable. We keep you focused and we actually might kick you in the butt a little bit until you take action to get some results. Now, when I was an athlete, I didn't take this piece too seriously. It wasn't until I was invited to Hockey Canada's Under-22 program that I realized the importance of it. I can give you the best strategy in the world, but if nobody is there to help you bust through fear and procrastination and self-doubt, you're never going to follow it. Now, I want you to imagine what it looks like when you have all the pieces in place. You stepped up. You got the help that you needed, and now you have complete control over the recruiting process. You have a system in place that allows coaches to get to know you, see you play. You know how to communicate with them with confidence. You know your value and what you can add to their team. You know how to find scholarships to offset tuition costs. At the end of the day, you can look at yourself in the mirror and tell yourself that you did everything in your control to create the future that you want. That's what I want for you. And the more that I can empower you to create that future, the more teams you can empower and help become successful. And that's what I live for. Helping people makes me come alive. So to make that picture real, there are a few dangers that you need to avoid. Because a lot of people have this dream of playing hockey in university, but you know what? A lot of people don't actually create those outcomes. A lot of people struggle. There are three big giant traps that you need to avoid to take control of the recruiting process. And if you fall into any of them, then this big, amazing, beautiful future is just going to be a dream. 
the first mistake you can make is to believe that you are not enough. Let me tell you something. You don't need to be the top goal scorer. You don't need to be on the top line. You don't need to have a shutout every single game. If you can fill a void that a coach needs on their team, then you have something that they want. You are enough. Now, maybe you don't know your outcome. Maybe you don't know what your strengths are, what, you, what value you bring. Maybe you don't know that you can make a difference on a university team. That's all okay. We can help you figure that out. The main thing is I want you to move into a radical new appreciation of yourself. I want you to see how powerful you are because no one is going to tell you that you're good enough. I'm telling you right now, you are good enough. You are ready now. The second trap you can fall into is not being willing to invest in yourself. And the truth is it takes money to have experts teach you the skills you need to be successful. Think about it. You pay your team, your organization, fees to teach you how to play the game of hockey. You pay your school to teach you math, science, history. To just play the game of hockey, you still have to buy skates, sticks, gloves. If you want to play university hockey, you have to invest in a plethora of areas to be your best and attain that dream. All of the success stories I shared in these videos all have one thing in common. They stepped up and invested in themselves to take control of their future. And the third mistake you can make is trying to do all of this yourself. Okay? So I conducted a little experiment when we uh, were in beta testing of this. I had about 40 people apply. I spoke to all of them on the phone. 10 of them ended up saying yes. Now 30 of them ended up saying no. And all of them ended up having similar reasons for saying no. You know, I got very, very clear on their university goal. They told me they wanted to be recruited by NCAA Division III or D1 coaches, but they decided not to enroll. And so about six months later, I came across all the notes that I had had from those conversations. You know, so-and-so wanted to play D3 hockey, that one wanted to go Ivy, this one wanted a small liberal arts college, and all of them didn't enroll because they thought they could do it on their own. So I thought, well, this will be interesting. Let me reach out to these people, and I'll check in and, and see how they're doing today. Now, how many of those people do you think actually went on to get recruited by the coaches, teams, and universities that they wanted to? I thought it'd be at least 5, 10, maybe 15 of them. The truth was, zero. Not a single person that I spoke to had managed to succeed. Nobody was any further along than when I first spoke with them. Some wasted thousands of dollars attending camps and showcases that they thought would help. Others were stressed beyond belief, and and one even quit playing competitively. It's about commitment. The pieces that you need the step-by-step recipe that we can give you because that's what we do. You need to step up and commit to yourself to create the university experience that you want. Look at that university goal that you made for yourself. You have to look at those powerful reasons as to why it's a must for you. And if you want this and you want it now, then you have to reach out and get the help that you need. So if there's one thing I hope you take away from these videos, I hope it's this. Yes, you can. Yes, you can take control of the recruiting process. Yes, you can earn scholarship money. Yes, you can contribute to a team. So to me, this is the whole thing. Control, freedom, contribution. How can you gain the most control? How can you create the most financial freedom? And how can you make the biggest contribution to the team that will recruit you? Now look, in these videos, I've only been able to give you the broad strokes. But if you're a person of vision, if you're someone who truly believes you can create the future that you want, then I know your mind is probably buzzing with possibilities right now. But here's the thing. Possibilities are not enough. It's up to you to make this real. And you know that's true because if you really stop and think about anything you've achieved in your life, it's been a result of you stepping up and making it happen. Life-changing success doesn't just happen. You need a plan. You need a step-by-step system. You need to follow it and you need someone to guide you and support you and hold you accountable. And the fastest way to get those results is to get help from those who are already getting those results every single day. You see, I believe there are moments when the universe kind of just taps us on the shoulder and gives us a glimpse of the future we want. So for me, that started back in high school when my best friend was competing for Team Ontario. I saw the path that I wanted to be on. A few years later, she had committed to an NCAA Division I school on a full athletic scholarship. It was another glimpse into the future I wanted. 
Later, she was competing with Team Canada's Under-22 program, and again, I saw that glimpse of the future that I wanted. She would talk of the training camps and the riot tests and beep tests and all these physical demands that were required of them. And now, I must admit, I'll be honest, back then I had no idea what a riot test was or, or half of the physical components they were being tested on, but I just kept thinking to myself, what if? What if? So right now, you have a choice. You've seen a glimpse of the future that you want, and you can turn away from that vision. You can turn away from the university goal that you set. You can turn away from the reasons why you need to achieve it. You can decide it's not possible. You can say, ah, well, other people can do that, but not me. And you can choose to settle. You can choose to settle for being less than you can be. Or you can do what I did. You can do what my clients did. You can take that vision and decide that no matter what happens, you're going to make it real. You can step into that vision, into that dream, and you can decide to start hitting that university goal that you set for yourself. If that's what you want, then here is what I have for you. My team and I have set aside some time in the next couple of days to speak to you personally about how you can apply these ideas into your recruiting process. So here's how it works. We'll get on the phone for about 45 minutes, and on that call, we are going to get you clear on three things. One, what's the most valuable outcome you can provide a coach in university? Number two, what's your exact athletic and academic goals? And three, what is the best strategy you should be using for finding the team you need? So we'll come on the call and we'll speak for about 45 minutes and we'll get you clear on all three of these things. What is the outcome that is so special that you can provide a coach in university? What your athletic and academic goals are? And what is the strategy you should be using for finding that team that you can bring value to? Because like I said before, Every single player needs something different. And on these videos, I can give you the very broad strokes. But if you really want to make these things happen, we have to get right in there, see where you're currently at in the recruiting process, and figure things out together. We're willing to do that for you, and we're willing to do that for you for free on that 45-minute call. But look, here is who this is for, because it's not for everybody. We have just a couple of simple requirements. You must be committed to hitting your academic and athletic goals with total integrity. You must play on a competitive team, and you must be in good academic standing. Here's the catch, though. Our calendars fill up very fast. I only have so many people on my team, hundreds of people watch these videos, so grab your spot right now. If you click over and you see our calendar and there's no spots available, then I'm really, really sorry. To avoid that, go book an appointment, right? Go and click that button underneath this video right now. And what that is going to do is you click that button, it takes you to our calendar, and on that calendar, you will see all of our available appointment times. Just grab whatever appointment time works for you. We will call you at that time that you picked, we'll talk for about 45 minutes, and we'll get total clarity on how these ideas fit into your recruiting process. Okay, so look, the stuff I've been sharing with you here, and we've done a lot in these videos, and thank you for being here with me throughout this process. The stuff I'm sharing with you is simple, but it's not easy. Trying to do this stuff on your own can be detrimental. You're going to make mistakes. You're going to spend money on the wrong camps and showcases. So why not just reach out and bypass all those headaches? This is what we do every day. It's what we do for all of our clients. So let us give you a hand. And if you don't do that, honestly, nothing's going to change. You will still be in the same position you are today. So click the button under this video, book an appointment, and we will get you on the path of taking control of your recruiting process. I'm Jacqueline Hawkins. Thank you so much for hanging in with me for this video course. I hope that you learned a lot, and most importantly, I hope that we've opened the door of possibilities for your recruitment process. I hope that you take that step into the recruiting process where you commit to hitting your university goal while creating the financial freedom through scholarships. That's what I want for you, and I would love to help you do it. So click the button under this video, book your appointment now, and we'll talk soon.